The safest and most tranquil nations in the world are ranked by the Global Peace Index. This study is released every year by the Institute for Economics and Peace, a group that describes itself as an independent, nonpartisan, nonprofit organization dedicated to turning the world's focus to peace as a positive, feasible, and tangible measure of human well-being and progress. The GPI study, which evaluates each nation's level of safety or hazard using 23 distinct factors, covers a total of 160 nations. The number of violent conflicts both domestically and abroad, the degree of mistrust, political unrest, the likelihood of terrorist attacks, the number of homicides, and the proportion of GDP that is spent on military expenditures, are among the factors used to calculate the GPI. These metrics are categorized into three major categories. Ongoing international conflict, societal safety and security, and militarization. For each of the 163 countries included in the report, a score is determined. The country's safety ranking increases with a lower score. Here are the top 10 safest countries in the world. Watch to the end of this video, because you do not want to miss it. Number 10. Japan. For 14 years, Japan has ranked among the top 10 nations on the Global Peace Index, routinely earning high rankings for low crime rates, little internal strife, and almost no political turmoil. Oil. Japan's proximity to China and North Korea, both of which may be hostile neighbors, could eventually endanger its safety. But this hasn't happened yet. Because the Japanese do not consider owning a gun to be a personal right, the country is notorious for having restricted immigration and access to weapons. Number 9. Singapore. The strongest sense of personal security and the most favorable interactions with law enforcement were reported by Singaporeans in a Gallup survey from 2018, compared to an inhabitants of all other nations. Due to the harsh punishments meted out for even minor crimes, Singapore has one of the lowest crime rates in the entire globe. In Singapore, violent and confrontational crimes are uncommon, since the government and police carefully regulate guns and other armaments. Number 8. Czech Republic. Over time, crime rates in the Czech Republic have consistently fallen with violent crime rates in particular experiencing a large decline. Both terrorism and natural calamities are uncommon in the Czech Republic. Last but not least, the Czech Republic is home to numerous modern, effective hospitals as well as a state-run health insurance program that provides reasonable premiums and permits almost universal coverage. Number 7. Slovenia. The great results Slovenia received in not one, but three distinct categories travel security, health hazards, and road safety are what give the country, one of the former Yugoslavias, its high safety ranking. Slovenia, like many Slavic nations, assured in democracy in the middle of the 1990s and is currently concentrating on raising standards of living in a variety of sectors, such as sustainability and safety. Number 6. Portugal. Portugal was ranked 18th globally in 2014, but has subsequently made great progress. Portugal has armed police, unlike Iceland and New Zealand. Island. Yet the country's crime rate has declined as a result of enhanced police presence. Portugal's unemployment rate has dropped from over 17% to around 7% in recent years, thanks to the country's economic recovery. Portugal consistently ranks among the finest nations for retirement, in large part because to its high degree of safety. Number 5. Austria. In terms of global safety in 2022, Austria was rated 6th. Austria is a very safe place to visit, despite the fact that violence protests following ongoing social unrest still pose a threat. However, these can usually be avoided. Crimes of great severity are rare, with the usual caveat to watch for pickpockets and purse snatchers. Furthermore, no significant terrorist attacks in recent years have occurred in Austria. Number 4. Denmark. Denmark is one of the world's safest and happiest nations. One of the few nations where people, including youngsters, say they always feel safe is Denmark. High levels of equality and a strong sense of shared responsibility for social welfare are two characteristics of Denmark that contribute to its residents' emotions of security and contentment. In Danish business and politics, honesty and trust are valued highly, hence corruption is uncommon. Although Denmark has a high personal income tax, this money goes toward social programs that make sure everyone has access to benefits and services that make their lives comfortable. Number 3. Ireland. Ireland significantly improved its level of peace in 2021, moving up the ranks from 11th to 3rd 
in 2022. Outside of a few major neighborhoods, crime is surprisingly low. Although, as in any country, one should be on the lookout for pickpockets and con artists in locations with plenty of tourists. And there isn't much of a threat from terrorism or acts of cultural violence. Ireland's environment may perhaps be a bigger threat to safety than its citizens are. Number 2. New Zealand. In terms of safety, New Zealand ranks second in the world. Similar to Iceland, New Zealand has an extremely low crime rate, with violent crime being particularly uncommon. Even yet, there is still little risk overall, and it is always wise to exercise caution, particularly in tourist regions. Contrary to its neighbor Australia, which is well known for its lethal species, including box jellyfish, taipan snakes, stonefish, funnel web spiders, and others, New Zealand is devoid of lethal creatures. The majority of New Zealanders are liberal, and the country has rules that forbid anyone from being denied their right to free speech or expression. Number 1. Iceland. Iceland is the world's safest nation for the 14th year in a row, according to the Global Peace Index. 340,000 people make up the Nordic country of Iceland, which is quite small. Due to its high standard of living, small population, strong social attitudes against crime, high level of trust in its well-trained police force, and lack of tension between social and economic classes, Iceland has an extremely low crime rate. The police in Iceland do not carry weapons on them, and there is no military in Iceland, only extendable batons and pepper spray. Equal pay for men and women, same-sex marriage, and adoption are all allowed in Iceland, and there are other regulations in place to protect equality in that country.